It's a steamy early morning here at Rose Field as the New Look Panthers get set to take on the winless Cougars. Hello everyone, I'm Logan Rose alongside Luke Rose and we're here for the rivalry. And while it looks a little different, it's still the same two teams that are part of the biggest rivalry in wiffle ball. As for the rosters today, we got Soren on the mound for the Panthers alongside Cade. And then for the Cougars, you got Bryson and Reed Ross making his uh, debut in the league. And as we talked about earlier, the bad blood between these two teams still may be there. As you all know, Soren talks a lot of smack. Reed Ross will talk a lot of smack, as you see in a couple of minutes here in this newly found version of the rivalry. Yep, that's all we got. Let's go down to game one. Here we go, Panthers, Cougars, the rivalry. Bryson Livingston on the mound to start it off. Etheridge, the leading candidate for MVP, will lead it off. The bases are loaded for Cade Jeffrey. Livingston shows another look in that strike three, first out of the inning. Good pitch from Livingston, strike three to Etheridge. Can he fight back here? Cade already atop the league lead in RBIs, and there's another one. One to nothing Panthers here in the first. You can feel a big moment coming. Good rip up the middle from Etheridge. That ball is not unplayable, and that's a double. Scoring two runs. Three to nothing Panthers here in the first. Three, two. And that's strike three. Here's Bryson Livingston goes yard on first pitch. What a way to bounce back. His fourth home run of the season. What a moment from Livingston to start off the bottom of the first. We said we'd have excitement and we have it. First AP of the season. And he's gonna let it go foul, but it does not. Single for Reed Ross. Etheridge trying to get on the board with an out. Nice screwball popped up. And that ball is a triple. Unplayable. The Cougars are known to be one of the better hitting teams in the league, and it's showing right here without their captain, Mason Ferris. Ross has an aggressive swing. Will that come into play here? Ripped left side. That is gone over the left field fence. No, it just came back, it's come back. Unplayable triple for Reed Ross. Four straight hits to start the game. Nice pitch, perfect speed at 75. 2-2 two -two to Reed Ross. Nice pitch from Soren. Back to back strikeouts. Can he get out of the inning? in a tie ball game at three. Nice pitch from Soren in an incredible at bat. We're gonna show you the whole thing. Like Etheridge, he's an MVP front runner. He can figure it out on the mound as Jeffrey chases in the dirt. One down in the inning. Strikes have been a problem for the Cougars this season. And once again, they bring in a run, making it a four to three ball game as Cade Jeffrey steps up to the plate. One out, bases loaded, down low. Five to three ball game as the ball bounces into the announcer's booth. If anyone knows Soren, they know that he says four ones for Daddy Axe, but he takes right there as we go to a six to three ball game. The walk fest from Altitude Wolves has been brought into Panthers Cougars. Ripped. 
Over the right field wall, that's another home run for the Cougars. Bryson Livingston continues his tear at the plate, but they remain down quite a bit here. Nice screwball taken yard from the rookie. The second overall pick continues his debut in impressive fashion, and he has hit for the cycle. What a moment from Reed Ross. Nice pitch, that's it. An absolute marathon of a game ends in a 17 to eight final as the Panthers take game one here. Game two, Jeffrey on the mound, second appearance of his career, ahead in the count here. Another one, hit left side into the bushes. That's gonna drop, still in play. And Bryson's going home, a run scores for the Cougars. A big day at the plate for Reed Ross continues. Number two overall pick looking good. Strike three, Jeffrey took some off of that. Jeffrey is in a rhythm. Strike three tipped into the zone and Etheridge loves it. 0-2. Oh, Strike three, Key Jeffrey. Three straight strikeouts, works out in the inning. Here's Reed Ross on the mound. Two hits in the series so far. The rest of the runs coming via the walk, and that is strike three. Jeffrey chases in the dirt. First and second, two outs. Riser inside, and we go to bases loaded in a one to nothing game for Cade Jeffrey. Etheridge providing encouragement. Full count, bases loaded. Panthers trail one to nothing. Slider hits him in the head and we have a tie ball game. And once again, walks are an issue for the Cougars. Nice pitch from Reed Ross Not at 76. Gets out of the inning. We go to the top of the second, tied at one apiece. The rhythm has been broken just a bit, but oh not right there. One of the furthest balls we have ever seen at Rose Field was just destroyed. Reed Ross continues an incredible debut at the plate. Oh my God. Three, one game. As we've seen, not over yet. That's Ripped fair, down the fair. line, ground rule double. Ross trying to get back on the board with another impressive hit. Chases one in the dirt. Dirty pitch from Cade Jeffrey. Ripped up the middle with a lot of spin. Ground rule double. Bryson Livingston driving in a run, making it four to one. Despite the 4-1 lead, we've seen games like this slip away pretty easily. Like that crazy. ball is gone. Bryson Livingston just barely keeps it inside the foul pole. Etheridge comes in and gets it out, tipped into the zone. And that's gone, Bryson Livingston with his seventh home run already in the season. And that's the game. We go to game three. Game three, tie series. Here's the rubber match. Ground ball right side, Jeffrey's under it and pegs him. We are gonna go to review on that. Popped up into the Oleanders. Ooh. Cade is under it. That's an unplayable triple for Bryson Livingston. 
We are playing one inning in this game. Panthers are the home team after the Cougars volunteered to switch. And that's a ground rule double for Reed Ross. Popped up, Etheridge under it. And there are two down here in the inning. That ball is gone. Reed Ross once again. Kate Jeffrey into the game for Etheridge. Right side, unplayable triple. All right. Jeffrey trying to get out of the inning. And he does on a nice dropper. We go to the bottom of the last. Panthers trailing four to nothing. And that's strike three on a nice little screwball from Reed Ross. Down low, bases are loaded with one out. Etheridge took a big hack on 4-0. Inside, it is a four to one ball game. Just that presence, I think. Inside, four to two ball game. And that's strike three, two down for Cade Jeffrey. And a great at bat from Kate Jeffrey to make it a four to three ball game. Four three, Etheridge, Ross, full count. Outside, nearly hit him, and here comes Kate Jeffrey in a tie ball game. Carson huddles up the Panthers as we go to a full count with the bases loaded in a tie ball game. Jeffrey at the plate, trying to win the game. Up high, Panthers win. And it's a questionable decision, and that's it.